everyone, it's Michaela, aka the Ginger Ninja Grimber. So not too long ago, my uncle made some jalapeno poppers, and they were all right. And I told him they were all right, and he challenged me to make some better ones. So that's what we're doing today. So we usually make them in the oven and bread them, but today we're trying something completely new on the Blackstone. So here I've got them, and I'm just cutting them now. Actually, wait, we have to cut the stem off. I almost forgot, man. So just cut the stem off, not too short, because we're going to um, scoop the insides out and put cheese in. And when we cook it, we don't want the cheese to fall out. So I'm just cutting it through the middle here. So now, oops, there we go. So now there's a little spot here, and I'm just going to cut it, so, but not too Deep so the stuff doesn't fall out. Just like that. Now I'm going to scoop the insides out. Okay, here we go. So in just a second, I'll get these all out. But here we've got it all fully done. So what we're going to do is we want them exact. So we're going to put them like this. We'll get our stuffy inside and then we'll wrap them in bacon. And then we'll cook them. So I'll get the rest of these cut up and scooped out. We'll make our um, filling for the inside and then I'll get back to you. Okay, so I've got them all cut up, so now I'm going to make the inside in them. Um, but first, earlier I cooked up um, some bacon, and not like too cooked, because that's what we're going to use to wrap around, and it will just make it a bit easier. So now we're going to make it. So we've got two blocks of cream cheese here. You can basically use anything for yours. You don't have to do this exact because it's pretty hard to mess up. Now some cheese here. Okay. Now we've got, um, when I cooked that bacon up, I also cooked some more little pieces of bacon up. So I'm going to put these all in. And then a bit of roasted garlic seasoning. Okay, now I'm gonna get this all mashed up and then once we get this all mashed up, we'll go out to the grill and I'll get back to you. Okay, so now I am going to make one here. So I'm just adding our filling that we made. So we'll get it on one side and then we'll get the match to it and put it on the other side. Okay, now we're going to put this together. And I'll just wipe the excess off. So now I'm going to wrap it in our bacon. I might have pre-cooked our bacon a bit too much, but that's okay. So I'm going to put a toothpick on, um, at where we start with the bacon, and then I'm gonna wrap it around like that. And then I'm going to add a, another toothpick where the bacon ends. So there we go. It's not that pretty and I am not a professional, but I'm sure we'll get these all made, we'll grill them, and they'll taste great. So I'll get the rest of these done and then I'll get back to you. Okay, so now I'm going to get them on. I've got to admit, they're not so pretty, but I'm sure they'll still taste amazing. So I'm going to get them on here and we'll move them around the toothpicks and stuff and then see what we end up with. Okay, so they're coming along um, pretty well. They're falling apart, but that's okay. Um, I'm sure they'll still taste great, but they're falling apart. So what I'm doing now is I'm just taking the tooth, um, out of them and then just putting them back down 
So I'll do that for the rest of them. We'll keep moving around and then I'll get back to you. Okay, so I've got all of my toothpicks out. So some are looking better than others, but I'm sure they will all taste a bit um, great. But to add a bit of flavor, I'm going to put on some freshly grated Parmesan cheese. So I'm going to put a fair amount on each one, and I'm going to let this crisp up, and then I think it's time to try it. Okay, so they're coming along amazing. I think it's time to get them off and try them. Okay, so now I'm going to try it. I've got some ranch here, so I'm going to dip it in there. These are so delicious. I love these. Wow. These are amazing. These make a great snack. And remember, if you like what you see, please hit that subscribe button and share with your friends. You can even hit that like button. Thanks for watching. Bye.